Some people consume sugar substitutes because they think it's a good way to cut back on calories and stay healthy. But some studies suggest that these artificial sweeteners may actually raise your blood sugar levels and change the types of bacteria in your intestines. Changes like this could potentially lead to obesity, high blood sugar, and lots of other health problems. Decades ago, vintage ads billed sugar as a diet aid, a quick source of energy with few calories. But not all energy sources are created equal. Some might give you a quick boost, but will leave you craving calories in no time. These inefficient energy sources can also lead to weight gain and obesity. Many processed foods have extremely high levels of added sugar. Eating healthier foods with protein, fiber, and good fats will keep you satisfied longer. In their quest to depict sugar as a health food, vintage ads were quick to point out the high level of sugar in fruit. While it's true that fruit contains a fair amount of natural sugar, it also comes packaged with nutrients, fiber, and a low energy density, and that makes it difficult to overeat on. Added sugar, the stuff you always find in bottled fruit juices, is what you really need to watch out for. These are just empty calories, similar to what you'd find in soda. Many so-called health products are sweetened with organic cane sugar. What the makers of these products don't tell you is that this raw sugar delivers no actual health benefits, even when you compare it to regular sugar. The processing method might be different, but the chemical makeup is the same. If you overconsume it, your body and metabolism will suffer in the same ways. With all these sugar-related problems, you might be tempted to cut sugar out of your diet completely, but not all foods labeled sugar-free are truly free of added sugar. Many recipes that make this claim have simply replaced sugar with agave nectar, honey, or other substitutes that are just sugar by another name. Since the body is less efficient at breaking down these high fructose alternatives, sugar-free foods can actually be worse for you. If you can, always choose unprocessed foods that have as little added sugar as possible. 